Hi, I'm Ted. Today I'm going to show you how to input an exponent in Excel. I have a small spreadsheet here and what we're going to do is make a table of the squares, the cubes, and the square roots of the numbers from 1 to 10. So to make a formula, you click on the cell where you want the formula to be, where you want the result to be, and you type in an equal sign and then you click on the number over here, number 1, or cell A2 where the number 1 is, and then you type um, the exponent symbol, which is the caret, which is the symbol above the letter, the, the number 6 on a keyboard. And then you type 2 because the exponent is 2. And then you hit a return. And sure enough, the square of 1 is 1. Now we want to copy that down to the other cells. We could go and type in the formula on each one, but there's an easy way to do this is we click on the cell and then we move the cursor until it to the bottom right of the cell until it changes to a solid plus and we click and drag down and what that does is that drags down the formula so that it the same formula appears in the corresponding cell in each row. Now let's do the same thing for the cube. We type equals, click on cell A2, type in the caret, the exponent symbol, and now we type in a 3 because now that's our exponent. Hit return and then do the same thing, select the cell, click on the bottom right, drag down, and there's the cubes of all the numbers. Now the square root um, is going to be a little bit more involved, but we can type in equals, and we type the, the cell A2 and the exponent symbol, and now there's two ways we can do it. We can type a 0.5 because the exponent is 1 half, or we can actually in parentheses put a 1 over 2. So either way you get the same answer. I did it the, the second way. Hit return, and then we do the same thing, click the cell, put the cursor on the bottom right, drag down, and there's our result, the square roots of all the numbers. So I hope this has been helpful. I'm Ted, and today I showed you how to input an exponent in Excel. Thank you for watching.